Yeah. Guys, here we are with Robbie Benton, the <coughs> Dark Horse, beating Charger 3 1. Happy to There's a lot of room for improvement in their performance, but you're going to get that with, with a pre-season game, so it uh, bodes well for us going forward. Yeah, and um, in my opinion, uh, from, the, from, like, from the moment Jota got that goal, from like, the moment you guys equalised, uh, there was a bit of, I don't, I don't know what was missing, there was a bit of like, spark missing it towards the team. Does that happen a lot? Yeah, well, I like, well, well, it kind of happen a lot. Well, like with any game, when you know, we, expect to, we expect it to win today, and when you go behind early and things aren't working, you uh, players can get a bit frustrated myself included so um, as well as that it's only pre-season and you know it's only our second game playing never everyone together and new lads getting in so it'll take us it'll take us time to, to you know for everyone to click and hopefully we can do that as soon as possible uh, for you as a for you as a player just get back to fitness and after the off-season how important is like pre-season to get the legs moving again and uh, get back to practice for the new season yeah it's you know it's a really important time of year nobody you know particularly likes the first couple of weeks of pre-season but Thankfully now we're into games and you know you can get your fitness that way and get your match sharpness back. So um, we're going away next week now for training camp. So everyone's looking forward to that. Looking, looking forward to the nice warm weather in Spain. It's kind of cold tonight, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's um, you know it's, it's a nicer environment. So, you know morale will be a little bit better when you know you're, you're training in the sun rather than um, you know the cold and oriel here. So. Um, everyone's with each other 24-7, so it'll be good for, for team morale as well. And you're looking forward to the start of the new season? What are yeah. your hopes and the expectations? Yeah, chomping at the bit, especially the way the last season ended and losing the cup final on a penalty shootout. And, you know, if the penalty shootout goes the other way, kind of the narrative changes. We, we're double cup winners and you know, everyone's you know, leaving on a high coming into the season. But you know, it was tough to get over at the end of last season after the cup final. and. You know, it's kind of given everyone a renewed hunger to, to go and you know claim back the league and, and try and win the cup as well. You know, you're talking about the renewed hunger. Uh, Cork nearly lost the league. You came really close to um, actually taking the league from them. Does that give you much more hunger to go and retain that league title? Um, I suppose. You know, we're just disappointed that we lost the title. It didn't really, you know, matter that we almost caused them. We, we, did, we didn't catch yeah. them. So, uh, you know, that was disappointing. And, you know, all we can do is is our best and you know we've we brought in you know uh, four or five top quality players and you know they'll give us uh, you know a, a different edge this year. Thanks, Bobby.